All right, we're here at a tire shop right now. We're gonna actually use the items that we just received. We're gonna take a look at them and see how they work. So we're here at a truck tr tr truck tire shop, all right? So just make sure that the equipment that you're using is for trucks. And if you guys need help, you guys can come in here in the tire shop. Hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs> Ay, practicó. ¿Sí? Sí. Y que no, no me va a ganar. Here, once it closes the jaw, the pin pushes down the tire and the tire gets released. Here, you could go into the next step. Today, we're gonna bring a tire bead breaker kit. Uh, everything in here is included, including the hose. So let's go ahead and set it up. All right. He's pulling um, plumber's tape here on one end. He's making sure the hydraulics pump is actually nice and fitted in there. We're setting it up. See, see. Just to be safe, we're gonna not gonna hand tie it. We're gonna tool tie it just so we can make sure that the pressure is strong. Con la pompa de Eso para qué es así? Este es para ajustar el, el, el pistón este. O oh, oh, manual, ¿verdad? Manual, sí. Ok. Lo ajustas así. Manually open it up. Ya lo ajustas. No lo. You can manually lower it down by opening the top, and then there's an Allen wrench that you were required to actually drop more of the teeth. So this is a process that's not necessary, but if you have issues or you want to release the mechanism, you can do that. Oh, is that the wrench to lower this one up? Yes, so it can come out more. Okay. So we've got our airline here, our pump machine, and he's loosening it up so he can open it more up, all right? And he says the Allen wrench, He's gonna show you guys with the Allen wrench how to open it manually more. For, oh, for the bottom part. Yeah. Okay. All right, so you're gonna need 120 at least air pressure for this one to work. Uh, there's a couple of levers things that you need to be aware. You could modify it to fit the tire by removing the bottom plates, as we did in one of the videos. Uh, releasing mechanism is simple. You do need to actually make sure that you have the bracings in there. Make sure you're fully oiled before you even start. They even give you a warning on this. The foot pedal, sim easy. And then the release button here and simple to use. Now, one of the things that we noticed that you gotta make sure it fits the wheels, all right? And if you see the video that we're doing it, this goes in the center, this goes out, and it was able to release the wheel. So, simple to use. We're here at a tire shop. I hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs> 